What's up, Sun Rays? Welcome back to my channel. It's Ray. If you're new here, welcome. If you saw the title, then you know we are going to be talking about mousses today, what my favorite mousses are that I have tried. But before we get into talking about the mousses, I wanted to share with you these glasses that I got from Hip Optical. So as you know, I like to give my eyes a break and every once in a while, I will take out my contacts and put on glasses. So with that being said, Hip Optical reached out to me and wanted to send me a pair of their glasses to try out and share with you. I said yes, so they are partnering with me. They have a wide range of frames that you can choose from, and I happen to choose these. I wanted to make sure that if I was bringing something to you, it was something that I liked, so I ended up getting the prescription glasses. You can get blue light, you can get sunglasses, you can get just reading glasses, whatever. I chose prescription because I figured if they could get prescription right, they would be able to get the other things right. So far, I am liking these. They do have my prescription right. I can definitely read. I like the style of them, so I wanted to bring them to you. So to give you a few little details about HIP, one, they are made in the USA. Check, love that about them. Two, for every pair of glasses that you buy, HIP donates a pair of glasses to the needy. Check, love that about HIP. Also, they give you a 30 day money back guarantee. So if you get your glasses and you wear them for 30 days and you still are not completely satisfied, you can send them back to the company for a full refund and you don't have to pay a restocking fee check with hip you get stylish frames all different colors and shapes and sizes you also get the ultra thin lenses included that's great for someone like me who has a really high prescription and i wear progressives on top of that so with hip you can get a single vision pair of prescription glasses for 95 dollars if you want to add on blue light things like that that will take the price up a little bit but it's going to be way less than what you would pay at a regular regular optical store in your area. If you are getting progressives, they're going to be a little bit more because again, they're progressives. But when I would just go into my local place and try to get progressives and try to get blue light and try to get, you know, light responsive on it, I'm paying upwards of 400 and something dollars for one pair of glasses. With hip optical, you can get those things for way less than that and they are light on my face. So these are called the Melvin Aphrodite frames and they are the ones that I pick, but they are very nice. So I do wanna let you know, I will have a link to um, Hip Optical in the description box. If you decide to purchase from Hip, you will get $15 off your first pair of glasses if you use code RayRay. And if you wanna buy two pair of glasses, you'll get $30 off your order. This is good for 90 days. So if you are in the market for a new pair of glasses, you just want to try them out. You want to support a company that the glasses are made in the USA, then this is your chance to do that and to um, save a little bit of money as well. So that is it guys. I just wanted to share those with you. Let's get to these mousses. Okay. So my very first mousse that I want to share with you that has become a favorite is the Pattern Curl Mousse. I used it not long ago. I'll leave the video linked here if you wanna see it, but I like this mousse. I wasn't sure about it. That's why I got the travel size, but when I went to use it, I loved it. It comes out in a foam, which I like. It's not one of those ones that's real bubbly and drippy. It smells good. It has a nice moisturized feel to it. So when you put it on your hair, you can feel the moisture in your hair. It does have some hold to it, which is nice as well. And I like the fact that it does not have any silicones and it didn't give me any flakes. So that's always a plus. So if you haven't tried pattern mousse, I'd say pick it up and give it a try. I really enjoyed it. The next mousse that I wanna share with you that I like is the Texture ID Thermal Multi-Styling Foam. It looks like this. And I have used this before with its cream for a no gel wash and go, and it turned out okay, but I hadn't used it for a twist out. So I used it for a twist out and I liked it. Again, I will link the video here so you can take a look at it. What I like about this one is the same thing. It's it pumps out nice and foamy like I like. It is very, very, very creamy. 
you can feel the creaminess to it and the moisture going on to your hair. It also smells good, has a very clean scent. I like the fact that it is affordable so you can get it at your local Sally's or you can order it from Sally's. It's somewhere around $8, $9, something like that for eight, ounce, eight almost eight and a half ounces. So that's good. It soaked right into my hair and my strands, which I like. There wasn't a lot of white sitting on top, which you can get with some mousses. This soaked right in and my twists looked really plump, which I liked. So this is a, a, a good one. This is, this is one that I definitely will repurchase because I like the Texture ID brand, at least this um, original line anyway so when i go to pick up other things from this line i'll probably will pick this up too but a little goes a long way i've used this multiple times and i'm only down to here so this is a really good one if you haven't tried texture id mousse you need to give it a try the next one that i want to share with you that made it to my favorites is the tailored beauty flexible curl uh, potion mousse which looks like this I recently did a twist out using this mousse and the uh, matching leave-in and I got a, a really good twist out with it. When I had, when I used it, it felt, um, I'll leave the video here, it felt very watery, didn't have any moisture. The leave-in really didn't feel real moisturizing. These are products from their Golden Herbal Collection, so they tend to go toward more strengthening properties. They have protein in them and things like that, so that is why you're not gonna get that same um, moussey softness. You're not gonna get that same moisture that you are gonna get from the previous two that I mentioned, but nonetheless, you get a lot of hold with this. Soaks right into the hair, and you also get nice, shiny, um, twists that just look real real tight and uniform and um, I was pleasantly surprised I was like I'm not sure if this is going to have the moisture I need or whatever but it did end up having a lasting moisture for the amount of days that I needed it for I didn't wear it for seven days if you're someone who wears your hair for seven days I don't know about that but I can say that it lasted the length of time that I wore it for and you'll know what that length of time is if you go to the video and you'll be able to see my hair. But this really surprised me. Again, a little bit goes a long way, so I, it's still full. This one comes out more runny and bubbly. So that is a con for me, but it's not a deal breaker because it is a good mousse. I just like it to foam, you know, I like my mousses to foam a little bit more. But I wanted to bring this to you for those of you who have color treated hair, who likes protein, who needs a little bit of a boost, some elasticity back in your hair, but you wanna use a mousse because you want the lightness, you want it to dry quickly, whatever. This is a good one. I'd say pick it up and give it a try. Yeah, it surprised me guys. And then last but not least, is the Design Essentials Almond and Avocado Curl Enhancing Mousse. You guys have seen me use this on more than one occasion. I'll link the videos there. It is almost gone, but this is the travel size. And I like this one. Again, this one is one that pumps out in a nice foam that I like. It gives your hair shine, it has a nice hold, your hair dries quickly with this one. The only kind with this one is that it does have a silicone in it, but other than that, this is a good mousse. This is a good mousse. It smells good too, has a nice little um, pleasant smell to it. So yeah, Design Essentials, you guys don't sleep on Design Essentials, it's good. And then I do have an honorable mention that I wanna talk about as well, that I think is pretty good too and it is the Curls Blueberry Bliss Repair and Grow Sculpting Mousse, which looks like this. Okay, so this one comes out more in that bubbly foam, which I don't care for, so that's gonna be a con, but it smells great. Again, a little goes a long way with most of these mousses, and this one, 
I really like to as far as um, the definition and everything that I got. I will say that this one did leave a little bit of a coating on my hair, not a whole lot, but a little bit of a coating on my hair if I remember correctly. So that is why it is a, an honorable mention. But would I probably keep this one on hand? Probably because I like the Blueberry Bliss line. So if I'm going to use this with something, I have a lot of stuff over there that I can use it with. That's the same with the Texture ID. If I'm going to choose a mousse, it's probably going to be this one or the Texture ID because I use a lot of things in those lines. So when I go to order, it makes sense for me to order everything that I need. Um, this one is good, but again, like I said, probably will steer away from it because of the silicones. But if it didn't have silicones in it, this would definitely be a contender as far as me repurchasing as well. This um, Taylor Beauty Mousse, again, I need to try some more of the Taylor Beauty products to see if this would be a staple. I just don't, I need to try some more stuff. I haven't ordered enough of their products or used enough of their products, I should say, on a continual basis to see if it's something that I would want to repurchase, but I'm definitely going to use this up because I like it and it's that good. So yeah, guys, that is it for my list of favorite mousses. Let me know what you think about this list in the comment section below. Let me know if any of these are on your favorites list for mousses. Let me know if there's a mousse that you like that I didn't list here. Leave that in the comment section below as well. And yeah, guys, that's it. I hope you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. Make sure that if you're interested in hip optical or interested in getting a pair of glasses, whatever type they are, that you click that link below head on over to HIP, and if there's something that catches your eye, you make sure that you use the code Ray Ray to get your $15 off or your $30 off, depending on how many pair of glasses that you purchase. Um, other than that, make sure you hit the notification bell so you'll be notified of my next upload. And until next time, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.